Hey guys, in this video, we're going to take a look at how you can use the edge panels task shortcut functions on the Samsung Galaxy S23 series. Now with the task shortcut, it allows you to quickly uh, execute a function that would normally uh, require you to take a number of different steps. Uh, for example, you can quickly take a photo by tapping on the a photo icon or you can um, um, view recent files so you just tap on it and it will automatically open up my files and it will show you all the recent files or you can quickly record a video you can quickly start recording a voice memo or take a screenshot by simply just tapping on the button and that will take the screenshot so instead of pressing on uh, the various combination of buttons on the on the side here to take a screenshot, you can simply just tap on the button or you can uh, create a new note or create a new contact uh, by simply tapping on the shortcut. So task is a very useful uh, widget that you can add on to your device. To, uh, to use it, first you need to add it to the edge panels. So to do that, uh, swipe down at the top and then tap on the settings icon. In the settings page, we go down and tap on display then scroll down and tap on edge panels in here tap on panels and scroll across and make sure you select tasks so select it first after that, you can go down and tap on the edit button now in the shortcut panel over here the task panel you are allowed at, um, to add up uh, to a maximum of 12 shortcuts so at the moment we have a few here so you can go down the list over here and you can uh, add in the function that you want to use so for calendar you can add detail uh, event or use you can open up the search calendar event now because i have already added up to the maximum of 12 tasks so i'm not able to add in anymore in order for you to add in a different function you need to remove uh, one of the existing one from the panel one of the shortcuts from the panel here so there is quite a few that you can choose so let's take a look what is available for you to select so for calendar you can have uh, the add details event search calendar event uh, for camera you've got uh, video and photo so when you tap on the video or photo shortcut uh, it will immediately open up the camera and then it goes directly into a video mode or photo mode ready for you to take a, uh, a photo or a video for clock you can add in the shortcut to add an alarm straight away view the world clock stopwatch or a timer so i can add in a stopwatch if you regularly using the stopwatch uh, you can go down and select contacts so you can create a new contact or search contact if you regularly uh, uh, Searching for contacts in your contacts app. You can add in the shortcut here You can uh, tap on view items so that uh, Let's say if you have a picture that you want to quickly always go back to the same picture so you can uh, create a shortcut to that photo And then you got view album down here. You could um, send a message so you can tap on send a message to a contact. So here I will select this contact. So whenever I want to send a text message to that contact, all I have to do is open up the task panel and then tap on that shortcut. It will allow me to immediately uh, open up the text, uh, the messaging app, and then it will open up the text uh, conversation with that contact. And then you've got compose uh, messages. Then you've got here for my files, you can add in view recent files for a phone call you can uh, add in make calls use keypad or view recent uh, calls so if i tap on make calls i can select a contact so if i tap on that that will, that will immediately uh, make a call that is very sim this is uh, this function is very similar to direct dial so that you're allowed to create a contact and when you um, create a contact shortcut and when you tap on this uh, shortcut it will immediately make the call to that contact, uh, contact next is the samsung internet you can view bookmark or open up a new tab uh, for samsung notes you can type a note right with a pen i believe right with pen let me see what it said uh, this it doesn't give you a full description here uh, paint with brush we cut voice file, uh, voice recorder, start recording. And you have some advanced features here. 
uh, take screenshot, record screen, and one-handed operation. All right, so we have one more slot here to add in, so I can choose type note. And again, if you find the list in the panel, um, it's not what you want, you can always uh, tap on the remove button and replace it with another item. And that's it. After, you can tap, after that, you can tap on the home button to go back to the home screen. Now, when you want to use task from the edge panels, just swipe in from the edge and then swipe across until you can locate the task shortcut. And then you can just tap on it to use the shortcut function. So that just take a screenshot uh, to type in a note. I can type on that shortcut and that will create a new note and I can paste in uh, from what I have just copied from the screenshot. And here I can make a call. So if I tap on the call or the direct dial shortcut, that will immediately place the call. So quite handy uh, to use the task um, panel uh, on the edge panels right here. And that's it. Thank you for watching this video. Please subscribe to my channel for more videos.